Good morning, YouTube land. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're working on a long-term project, which is this old super. Man, this horn's in great shape. The player has kind of had a, done a steampunk vibe to it over the years. We've got these cool custom caps. Those look really rad. We've done the ghost slide for him. Mod on that. And today we're going to be focusing on the third valve slide. So the way these would have come would have been your ring and like probably a plastic keeper or something like that to keep it from flying off. So we're taking motivation from, from steampunk, like motorcycle, custom motorcycles and stuff like that. I love mechanical stuff. And we actually want to see the mechanics of it this time. So I'm going to uh, use a, be using a, a ring and like this is a, vintage valve guide i think we can make some something really cool out of this come join along you get right up on the all the little details so now you can kind of start to visualize where it is that I'm going with the ring soldered on and put the third valve slide ring oh uh, well look new problem the ring is too tall so we'll have to make some adjustments to all of that, but not a problem, not to worry. Notice the file has got a super rough cut side and then a finer side. And I actually now I'm going to flip to this finer side and start molding it and shaping it. Let's see. So I'm going to determine the size of drill that I need for this piece by using my screw checker. And I know that it's going to be a size 3 and my tap is going to be a 348. Uh, let's see if I get that. Yeah, 348. And so um, it would call for a, a number 47 drill. My particular drills that are numbers are not of the highest quality. So I'm going to get that same thing. I'm going to use a 564 out of this American set. And that's what we're going to, that's what we'll drill. And then 
we use the 348 tap. As a side note, I use this hard, it's flexible, but it's hard rubber. Um, you'll notice that I lined across. The reason is, is that this vise is a cheaper vise, um, and it will not, it's tighter in the center than it is on the sides. So I use it to make sure that we're tight all the way to the outside. So you can pick this up at like McMaster Car. Let's see how it worked out. We drop it in here. So tab. Look at that. Boom. So there you have it. Turned out really, really nice. Catch. Drop down. Yeah, that looks great. And keeps with the vibe of the overall theme of his instrument. That looks pretty cool. Thanks for watching, everybody.